go. Hey, this is Brian LeVan, the head softball coach at the University of Southern Mississippi. I know we're all doing our part to stay isolated during this pandemic, but it doesn't give us an excuse not to try to improve our game. So I ask our players to put together a short video of their favorite drill they're doing at home to stay sharp. So without any further ado, here they are explaining and demonstrating those drills. Hey everyone, this is Brianna Blankenship from Southern Miss Softball. I just wanted to share my favorite catching drill that works on blocking and getting around the ball on each side of the plate, inside and outside, in middle. And this is especially good because if you don't have anyone to throw you balls, you can do this out in your yard by yourself. So go outside one and middle one and outside. And that's it. Southern Miss to the top. My name is Brealey Boykin with Southern Miss Softball and I'm here to show you one of my favorite drills to do while pitching. One of my favorite things to do is on the BOSU ball because it helps me engage my abdomen and work on my snap without using my legs. So here's an example. I hope y'all are all staying safe and Southern Miss to the top. Hi, my name is Kaylin Ladner and I'm a pitcher for the Southern Miss Softball team. One of my favorite drills to do while pitching is throwing the spinner. I love this drill because it's a progression drill. You can start on your knees and you can work standing up on your feet. And the goal is to see how far distance wise you can spin it. I like working on my curveball spin with this spinner and I'm looking for this flat rotation, okay? So I'm coming down and releasing it and trying to get that flat spin and rotation, okay? So here's an example. I hope everybody is staying safe and healthy and continue to work hard at home. As always, Southern Miss to the top. Hey everyone, this is McKenna Pierce from Southern Miss Softball, and I'm here today to show you one of my favorite drop ball drills. This is called drop dots. All you need for this is three dots that you can use paper plates, and there's no need for a catcher. In this drill, you'll pitch a drop ball from the mound and try to hit each dot. This drill will help you in throwing your drop ball at different levels. Let me show you how it's done. I hope this drill helps you a lot, and as always, Southern Miss to the top. Hi, I'm Kaylee Cruze. I'm an outfielder from Stuttgart, Arkansas. I don't have a name for this drill, but it works on two things. It works on your reaction time and getting your feet set to make a good throw to the infield. What you're going to do is have your back to your partner, and they're going to throw you a ball, and you have to run through it to get your feet set. Go! So I hope you're staying safe during this break. Southern Miss to the top. Nichols and I play softball with Southern Miss. Today I wanted to run through a drill that I've been working on with you guys. So for this drill it's called pre-pitch steps. Um, we're going to imagine that we have a pitcher and as she's going through her windup we're going to take two steps. Now on this last step is when the ball will be put in play and you'll run in the direction which you make up. So I'll go this way take two steps and then come back. Now this is supposed to be sped up just to keep you on your feet because it's really important to not be on your heels while you play. So this is how it'll look whenever you're doing it yourself. And then you'll get back and keep doing that over and over again. I hope you guys stay safe and stay inside. Hey y'all, I'm Lacey from Southern Miss Softball. I just wanted to share with y'all one of my favorite defensive drills that y'all can do at home while we are all stuck inside. So the drill that we're going to be doing, you start on your knees and you're basically just reading the hop. You either want to go pick the short hop or you want to sit back and take the long hop. You don't want to let yourself get ate up on the in-between hop. Right. That's the short hop. You want to get it before the ball plays you. from Southern Miss Softball. A favorite drill of mine to do is quick hands to work on my transfer. You don't want to flip the ball out of your glove. You want to reach your hand in your glove so you don't bobble it and you get a better grip on the ball. I hope you enjoy this drill.
Hey everyone, it's Tata from Southern Miss Softball. Today I will be demonstrating one of my favorite drills. This drill will help you stay low and throw from the slot and it will help if you have a fast runner running like to second base and you don't have time to stand up and make a complete throw. So here's the drill. You wanna drop your back leg and make the throw. And that's my favorite drill. You wanna make sure you stay low the whole time. I hope this really helps you improve your game and you work on it. Southern Miss to the top. Hey y'all, my name is Caroline World from Southern Miss Softball and I just wanted to share one of my favorite drills with you. I'm gonna show you a good pop-up drill that helps with finding the ball. This drill does require a partner and you and your partner will be facing the same way. Your partner will say go and then they will throw the ball in the air and you have to turn around, find it and catch it. Here, I'll show you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Go. Ball, ball, ball. Go. Ball, ball, ball. Hi, this is Madison Rainer from Southern Miss Softball. I'm here today to show you one of my favorite game drills. It's called the Falling Tree, and it helps you with your transfer to make sure you get power through the ball, but not too much over your front foot. First, you have to have your front foot behind your back foot. Make sure your shoulders are diagonal to the ball. And then you want to make sure you just want to fall through it. Thank you, and so let me to the top. Hey, I'm Caroline Casey, and I live 30 minutes south of Graceland, home of Elvis Presley. And I thought it was pretty ironic that one of my favorite hitting girls is called Elvis Presley, so let's check it out. and all his dance moves and all his hip rotations. This drill teaches us to throw our back hip and to keep our shoulders from flying out. So I hope everyone's staying safe and working on drills and Southern Miss to the top. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hey everybody, this is Destiny Brown from Southern Miss Softball and I'm going to show you what I do to stay sharp during my hitting during this quarantine. So one of my favorite hitting drills is Happy Gilmore. This drill is used to transfer your weight through the ball and using your legs while hitting. Hi, my name is Hannah Borden. I'm a catcher on the Southern Miss Softball team, and I'm going to be showing you my favorite drill, which is the box drill. And the box drill really helps to focus on keeping your front arm and your front elbow on plane with the ball, which is something we really focus on here at Southern Miss. So first, you can either use your normal bat or you can use a short baby bat, but I'm going to be using my bat. And all you do is you get your bottom arm and you put it on the top of the tape, and then you just want to create a box with your arm. So your, your bottom arm will go on top and your top arm will go on the bottom and you're just going to want to get your bat and place it on your shoulder at an angle just like you normally would when you're hitting. Just bring it down on your shoulder. And then all you want to do is make sure you keep your front elbow through the ball and you'll see how this drill works. So then you just swing. And that's it. That's the box drill. Hey, my name is Caitlin Passo and I play softball here at the University of Southern Miss. Um, today I'm going to show you my favorite drill to do at home and it is called two hand punch. The reason being is because I like to see the ball at contact. It just helps me hit better. Um, here in Loosetail, we make our own tees. Her name is Old Faithful. So now I'm just gonna demonstrate the um, drill for you. Thanks for watching today and Southern Miss to the top. Well, there you have it. It doesn't take a huge space, time, or equipment to do a little work every day. I know you want to work on your game, it's just easier not to. But remember, to always do the hard right over the easy wrong, and it will lead you in the right direction. Stay safe, God bless you, and Southern Miss to the top.